right. Good evening, everyone. Uh, Robert J. Morris here again. Um, uh, looking around, uh, checking different stories. I came across this piece here. It was on before its news. In response to Paris, Ted Cruz calls for airstrikes with more tolerance for civilian casualties. Yeah. Um, he goes on to say, it has been only hours, or sorry, the article goes to say, rather, it has only been hours since terrorist attacks left at least 120 people dead throughout Paris. Little is known about the attackers, their methods, or their motivations. But Ted Cruz already knows a solution, a bombing campaign that's not afraid to kill innocent civilians. We must immediately recognize that our enemy is not violent extremism. It is the radical Islamism that has declared jihad against the West. It will not be appeased by outreach or declarations of tolerance. It will not be deterred by targeted airstrikes with zero tolerance for civilian casualties when the terrorists have such utter disregard for innocent life. You know, this is a, this is a play-by-play uh, duplication of the events after 9-11. If you read between the lines, it's, it's exactly identical except for this is happening on a world stage. This is happening worldwide now it's not just it's not just america fighting out it, it, this is the whole web this is the whole tentacled creature that this new world order is anyway what what's uh the rest of the article saying here cruz did not specify where these airstrikes should take place or what they should be targeting cruz also called for a halt to any plan to bring or plans to bring refugees that may have been infiltrated by isis Ah, uh, to the United States. Previously, Cruz has misquoted U.S. intelligence officials to make the case against taking in Syrian refugees. There is no evidence yet that any refugees were involved in the attacks. Now, whether they are or not, you see the stigma that's being created. Um, it's bad enough that they're, they're they're creating a platform for fear by bringing these refugees into other countries, whether or not they're innocent isn't the point it's going to create an unstable environment in in our communities and such and you know people believe in the uh everything they see in the news they're they're going to assume they need to be you know secured welcome to the new world order right anyway yeah peace out guys uh this is just some startling news because this is uh this is happening the same way the 9-11 did. All right. Anyway, take care of each other. Peace. Desperate as that sounds, yeah, yeah. Take these walls and rip them, rip them down.